Hi, I'm Charlotte Levette with ChildCareLand.com, and today I want to share with you an Easter egg pom-pom match. This is a great activity for fine motor skills development as well as a math activity. You'll just need to have the Easter eggs, plastic Easter eggs that you pull apart and they open up and you can stick things in them, which we're going to do today. And you need to have pom-poms. And you may notice that my pom-poms have magnets on them. We've talked about this before that I like the pom-poms that are a little bit more weighted down. And um, because this is a fine motor skills activity, you still get that when you have to pinch, grasp, and pick these up. But this has the added benefit of magnets, which um, the pom-poms tend to stick together. So the children have to pull apart the magnets on there as well with that act, that part. And so in our basket, um, I usually have more eggs set out for the activity, but this is just a small area. So I only have one set of one through six. I would have several sets out in a larger basket to do. And um, you can pretty much put whatever number you want on the eggs, but you want to be careful because not a lot of pom-poms will fit into these eggs. So we've done as many as 10 in, in there. If you find smaller pom-poms, you can probably go higher with that. So what would happen is the child would come and sit down at the center. If they're working on the floor, that's fine too. And then they'd pick an egg. And so we'll do four. And um, you can do it either where they have to just put four of any color pom-poms in there or four of the pink pom-poms in here, which is what we, we've chosen to do today, is that they open up the egg and this has a four on it. And so they're going to find four pink pom-poms and stick it in the egg. And again, you have to pull these apart on here. And then they close their egg back up like so. And they would go on to another egg. I would usually have another basket set uh, on the side for them to put the eggs that already have the pom-poms in them on there. So, um, But again, for space purposes, I haven't done that today. And so we'll just do two of the yellow so you get just one more example here how this works it has a two and then child would find two of the yellow pom-poms and put those in and then close it back up and they would continue until they've done all their eggs that are in the basket just really a great easy simple hands-on activity that's great for fine more skills and of course math now if you wanted to you could always just use plain eggs and have the children put the same color pom-poms in the plain eggs without any number on it and then at the end of that activity, they would go back, open the eggs, and count how many of um, pom-poms are in each color egg, too. That's another way you could do this activity. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do so, so you can be notified when new videos are released. And also, please sign up for my free weekly newsletter at childcareland.com or childcarelandblog.com. And if you like the material I present in these videos, please like, comment, and share. As always, your support is truly appreciated. For Easter Egg Pom Pom Match, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com, and thanks for watching.